21st blog with Floor Current Technologies. I'm Emily. And I'm David. Have you ever shopped for carpeting and find that you're confused with all the different styles and carpet fibers? Although we don't sell carpet, my dad has been a certified carpet inspector for more than 27 years, so he has helped many clients make the right choice for their home or office. Stay tuned, and David and I will unpack the differences between carpet fibers. The type of carpet fiber you select will determine how long your new carpet lasts, how soft it feels, what colors are available, how easily it cleans, and how much it costs. This is one of the most critical factors when choosing and comparing new carpet. Today, the most common synthetic fibers are nylon, polyester, olefin, and PTT. So, let's start with the most common, which is nylon. Nylon is the most resilient fiber used to make carpet. This is what keeps a nylon carpet looking like new longer than any other fiber. Nylon is one of the more expensive fibers second only to wool. I would consider choosing a nylon carpet if you have a lot of foot traffic and longevity was my bas biggest concern. Nylon is a synthetic fiber that outperforms all other fibers. It wears exceptionally well, it's very resilient, it resists abrasion, it resists stains, and is easy to clean. Carpets made of nylon tend to look like new longer than any other fiber. Here's an important note, all nylon fibers are not the same. There are two types of nylon fiber. One is referred to as type 6 and is made by ANSO, and the other is type 66, also known as Stainmaster, made by Antron. Personally, I prefer the Stainmaster 66 nylon and think it is a better fiber, and here's why. Carpets of Antron 66 nylon typically have two times better stain resistance than carpets of type 6 nylon, 40% better color fastness to light, household bleach, and atmospheric contaminants than type 6 nylon, can last 60% longer than carpets of type 6 nylon, and has 60% better soil resistant than the carpets of the type 6 nylon. Well, you would think that with that resume, who cares about the other three fibers? Depending on your household, other fibers may have certain benefits specific to your environment, but we'll save that for another episode. Here's our Did You Know segment, where we attempt to point out small things that may make you say, I didn't know that. First, what's the hole in the spaghetti server for? I love spaghetti. Really, I love all carbs in general. And making pasta is an easy dinner staple in our home. While making dinner the other night, I got to wondering, does the hole in the middle of my spoon actually have a purpose, aside from letting the water drain out? I did some research, and it does have a neat use, it turns out. The little hole in your spoon is approximately one serving size of pasta. Number two, have you ever tried to get a small piece of aluminum foil or plastic wrap and the whole roll comes out of the box? It seems this problem has been addressed, but few people are aware of the existence of the end tabs that appear on the ends of boxes of aluminum foil and plastic wrap. These little tabs are called end locks. They are pointed task to hold the roll or foil or plastic wrap steady inside the box as you pull on it. Say goodbye to the endless toil and frustration of the roll coming out of the box as you pull, or the roll flopping around the box, especially as it shrinks and floating up against the cutting blade as you pull, causing you to clutch and bend the box to hold it in place. Just press in the tabs the first time you use the roll, and presto. Welcome to a whole new world. And now for your quote of the week. People demand freedom of speech to make up for the freedom of thought which they avoid by Soren Kierkegaard. Our services include carpet, upholstery, area rugs, tile and grout cleaning, as well as consulting on carpet-related issues. And now for an editor's note. This, will, this week will be the last live vlog mm -hmm. with David for a few months because he's heading off to Bob Jones University at the end of this week. Of course, he will still contribute to these vlogs via the magic of video editing. Mm -hmm. And besides, we had the logo design, so we're not going to change that. But as many of you may know, Dave has been working with us on the cleaning truck over the summer, and it's been fun to see and hear people's reactions when he shows up at their home. If you stuck around at the end of this video, please leave a comment letting David and myself know you appreciate all the information we pass along every week. In the words of Paul Harvey, good day.
And in the words of Four Term Technologies, it's, it's how cleaning, cleaning is done. done. Bye. Bye. And now for your quote of the week. Champions are champions, not because they do anything extraordinary, but because they do the ordinary things. <laughs> <laughs> now for your quote of the week. Champions are champions. <laughs> <laughs> Now for your quote of the week. Champions are champions not because they do anything extraordinary, but because they do the ordinary things better than anybody. <laughs> 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 and now for your quote of the week. Champions are champions not because they do anything extraordinary. Run <laughs> 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 to find your own clothes. <laughs> <laughs>